why are family trust elections so FTDT? Thank you, Stefan. It's a mouthful. Uh, why are they so important? So a lot of people think that FTEs are about losses, but don't forget that a major reason why we need it is for franking credits. Uh, it's a very common mistake to not have an FTE and distribute uh, franking credits to beneficiaries from discretionary trusts. And that is not effective. I have been caught out on that as well. Uh, so uh, to be eligible for franking credits, uh, the recipient needs to satisfy the 45 day holding period rule, which essentially means that if you have that if you own shares directly, you have to hold them 45 days at risk. So tiny. Uh, and if you hold them directly, uh, you you meet them, you meet that rule if you hold them for 45 days. But if you are a trust uh, and the trust holds shares and you are merely an object of the trust, as in you are an eligible beneficiary, it doesn't matter how long you've been an object of the trust, the 45 day holding period rule, you have not satisfied the 45 day holding period rule as a beneficiary of the discretionary trust. Um, and therefore you are not entitled to the, the franking credits. So always make sure if you are working on a discretionary trust and uh, there are franking credits, uh, as in the trust has invested in shares and has derived uh, dividends that you make sure the trust has an FTE in order to pass on that franking credits to its beneficiaries.